my gosh! Oh my gosh! He came up! Oh my gosh! Ah! 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 Holy cow! That's What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's Colin and Jay and we are starting <laughs> off today's video with something awesome. Today Jay and I just checked the mail and we got something awesome delivered to us today and we're going to cut, cut to the chase and show it to you right now. This is a brand new monthly subscription based box from a brand new company called Angler's Hall. But what's got us really excited about this box is number one, it's full of fishing goodies, and number two, it's unlike any other subscription box out there. Most monthly boxes are geared towards fishing tackle, and this one is geared towards fishing gear, such as pliers, bags, boxes, and even like rods even and reels. reels. That's awesome. And that was what was so intriguing about this box when we first heard about it. It's like, Jay and I, we have a ton of lures, and you can never have too many lures, right, Jay? No. Never, never. have too many lures, but... <laughs> We don't have all of the essential gears that go along with fishing. We, we don't always have we don't always have pliers on hand. We don't right. always have scissors. We're always needing more boxes. Always needing scales. And those are all the types of items you can expect to find in this Angler's Hall monthly subscription box. So we're ready to bust this box yep. open. We haven't <laughs> we haven't done any foul play. There's all the tapes still on here. We have no idea what's inside this box. I know you guys are excited to see what's in there too. So let's cut it open and see what we received in our first ever Angler's Hall subscription box. Oh, um, by the way, before we open this up, this is the advanced box. There's two different boxes, we'll talk about that in a little bit, but this is the advanced box, okay? We're advanced anglers here, right? <laughs> here we go. You wanna open it up? You got it. Okay. Oh my word! Wow. Okay. Wow, okay, okay. so <laughs> this, this is, cool. is really overwhelming. I'll give y'all first a little a glance. Look at this thing. This thing is full to the top and it starts off with a card with all the stuff that's in there. And I don't really wanna look at the card because I wanna be no, surprised. Yeah. But the card tells you know what items are in here and what like the retail value of it is and shows you how much you saved on all these items. And that's like an exciting part. So I'm gonna flip the card face down. I have not looked at the card. I just barely glanced at it. And the next thing that's on top is t-shirts. Check this out guys. Starting it off with some cool shirts. Angler's Hall has got their cool logo on there. I like it a lot because it's like a uh, to uh, topography map. I think that's a really cool yeah. uh, design. It's got a bass on there. Woo. Blowing in the wind. Angler's Hall, I got some cool shirts. And then there's like a bunch of fun Fetty stuff in here. I'm gonna turn the camera around and let you look in here. You ready, guys? Get you a little, little sneak peek. Yeah, it's like fun Fetty. That's what I call it. Ain't confetti. Take a look. So you can see already there's a hat. And there's some other stuff. I don't know what it is. <laughs> there's that fun Fetty all over it. There's so a fun. reel. There's a reel? There is a reel. There's oh a reel in gosh. there. Oh my gosh, Jay. What do you have to say about all this? This is amazing. Okay, let's open it up <laughs> one by one and see what all is in here. First of all, check out my shirt. That's an awesome shirt. Doesn't she look good in that, guys? <laughs> Comment below if Jay looks good in her Angler's Hall shirt. <laughs> I think she looks great in it. Aww. Starting off, got a hat. Got a hat. From 13 Fishing, got a cool 13 Fishing hat. It's actually kind of like, it's got a real tree camo pattern, so you can wear that in Deer Woods also. Oh. Huh, you got yourself a hunting hat, Jay. Pretty cool. I think that counts as blaze orange if you wear it backwards, especially. There you go. She's ready for the woods now. <laughs> so that's cool, from 13 Fishing. <laughs> And we said there wasn't baits included. I think, well, I don't think we didn't say there weren't baits, but there are some baits included in it. And uh, the first bait we pull out of here is an awesome, this is a new bait from Missile Baits. This is a Ned Bomb, Ned Worm. These are really cool. And this is a great color for right now. We should be out waiting. It's 100 degrees today, like it has been every day. And that'd be a killer. It's some oh, of these yeah. creeks here, put on a Ned Head, and I catch a smallmouth on it. That's an awesome bait, and that's a really good bait. That's a great bait. Sometimes you get subscription box and you get some things you're kind of like, eh, I don't really know what that is kind of crusty, but that's a good dang bait. Good job, down with that. Okay, we're two for two for good things, your turn. Hmm. It's like, what do you want to go for? There's still, I I, I'm looking in here, I can't, I really can't see everything in here. Something I'm really going exciting. for the reel. And that's okay. awesome, what kind of reel is that? Is that Creed? It's a 1-3, so it's the 13 fishing Creed reel, spinning reel, just kind of a mid-size, looks like a three, it says, yeah, 3,000 sized spinning reel, which is good for multi-species angling, just put on any spinning reel and go for it. Yeah. Really backwards, aren't you? <laughs> There you go. That's pretty cool. And we got this in the box. How many boxes do you know that include a reel within it? That's, That's cool. awesome. That's really cool. Okay, so we got a cool reel. I'm going in next. I'm gonna go for this big thing because I'm excited about it because I think I know what it is. This thing is sweet. Check this out, guys. 
Oh, cool. This is a box, okay? And I think, what's it called? The Big Jig Box. The Big Jig Box. And it's from Groove Fishing. Um, I've seen these online before, but basically, what it is, it's a box and it has all these individual slots on it. I'm gonna open it up so you can see it. I figure out how to open this up. I'm so good at opening things. Oh, it's magnetic, wow. Oh, that's cool. Look at all these individual slots in here. You can place your jigs. And like, I think that, I guess you could put your bass jigs in there, but you could put crappie, crappie jigs. jigs. You can put crappie jig heads. You could put your terminal tackle in there. You could store anything in there, really, if it fits. That's really cool. And I guess it's probably, I'm not sure if it's waterproof. Probably is, because it's a really strong magnetic seal. It says, the big jig box offers, offers the most efficient, secure, and organized way to store your large jigs and hooks. Patent pending silicone anchoring system holds large hooks extremely tight, keeping everything in its place. No other storage system can securely hold your jigs and hooks while keeping everything organized and secure. That's what they say, at least. <laughs> we can give it a try. It looks cool, I'm very intrigued by it. Yeah, I think it's awesome. awesome, I think it's an awesome idea. We can definitely put some jigs in there, put some hooks in there and see how well it holds. We'll be uh, showing you guys that later on. Oh, another bait? Another oh, that's bait. that's like a cool bait. These baits are cool. I actually don't it's have a, any of those. Oh, that's a, a weight bait. bait. That's I like awesome. I do too. So that's a Yozuri wake bait. That's really cool. It's a bluegill pattern. Bass are feeding on bluegill right now, right here. Bet you catch fish on that. That's awesome. These are really cool. That 3DB pattern is really cool. It's got a lot of shine to it. It's a good bait. Another winner. It's another shirt. It's another sort of like fish dry shirt. Sun protection. Sun protection. Jay and I love dry fish shirts. I'm wearing one right now. I'm always wearing them. I wear them like every day. Oh, this is cool. It's from Gills. It's a good brand. It's like a pretty expensive shirt, I think. Oh, wow. Cool. Check that out, guys. Thing. Another shirt in here. This one here will keep you protected from the sun. This summertime, keep you cool, keep you dry. Another good product out of the box. And I think we got one or two more things in there, maybe. Another tackle box. Check this out. This is from Lure Lock. This is a new company, relatively new company. And what's pretty cool about Lure Lock is that it has like this little gel base down here in the bottom and it locks your lures in place. So you, like if you put a crankbait in there, you don't want it to be like rattling around over beating up your other crankbaits, you know, like maybe scarring them up. You could just stick it right here in this little gel patch and it's not supposed to leave like any sticky residue or anything. It's just gonna keep all your place, all your lures in place. And uh, it's pretty cool. And these boxes are pretty durable too from what I've heard. I've never used one. So I'm excited to, you know, finally get to try out a lure lock little box and see how, see what the big buzz is about. Cause everyone's using them. Everybody's using them, everyone's talking about it. So. We'll see how good these are, and I think that's all we got in the box. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. That's a good haul. That is a good haul. A good haul from Angler's Hall. <laughs> and uh, so, we've already unboxed everything. Let's talk about how much we saved on today's monthly subscription box. Okay, so I, I got this box like kind of at the month transition. This is actually July's box. I have no idea what's an August box. That'll be arriving sometime soon, so that's exciting. So the card says that Gill's shirt was retail of $39.99, so that's $40 for the shirt. The Yozer bait was $10. The net bombs were four. Lure lock was 13. <laughs> so that's the pro value. And then adding on the 13 fishing reel, the 13 fishing reel was $65 retail. The groove box was 30. And then the 13 fishing cap was 20. So the total value for everything we got out of today's box retailed for $182.93. But thanks to Angler's Hall, we were able to save over 40% on all these items. So that's awesome. And like we mentioned earlier, we unboxed the advanced box. They also offer a pro box on their site for you to check out. So we're gonna leave a link to Angler's Hall in our video description for you guys to check out. And if you decide that you wanna try one of these boxes for yourself, you can use our promo code CJ10. You can save another 10% off your first box. So that's like up to like 50% off on all this tackle. Wow. That's awesome. This is good gear. This is really awesome gear. Yeah. Like this isn't crusty stuff. And that's really exciting. I mean, I've I've been disappointed before in the past with my box and as much crusty stuff and I'm like, dang it, I might have wasted my money. But I definitely don't feel like we wasted our money on this. It's really exciting. Again, we want to say a big thank you to Angler's Hall for hooking us up with all this awesome fishing gear this month. We're excited to try to, excited to fill these little boxes up with some of our tackle we already have inside. But what we're fixing to do now is throughout this video, we've been shooting just now, we've been out here looking at the lake from our picnic table and been seeing some bash just absolutely obliterating. They're going schools crazy. Of They've been going crazy and it just, there's, there's a school of them going right now actually. So we're fixing <laughs> to have to go out there and go try to catch some of those fish for you guys real quick. So you ready to go? We gotta yes, get those fish. We, no time, let's go. We gotta go. All right, guys, it's a steamer out here. We launched the canoe real quick. We're gonna paddle over. We saw the fish commotion going on. Hopefully catch a couple of those big bass we saw bouncing around.
I'm in the water. Maybe. Oh my gosh. Oh wow. I was like, they're doing it. Oh crap. Crap. We didn't get one. That was that was that was insane. Eat my bait. Oh my gosh, big ones. Big ones. Big ones. Big ones, Jay. Those are big ones. Those are big ones. Those are big ones. Oh my gosh, eat this bait. Eat this bait. Oh my gosh. He ate it. He ate it. He got him. Those are big ones. Get out of the grass. Those are big ones. Come on. I got the smallest one. I probably did get the smallest one. Those are big ones, Jay. Go. My heart is racing. But hey, that was my very first cast, so. That was your first cast. That was amazing. Good job, Jay. Whew. Crap, Ola. Oh, God, they're doing it again. Doing, doing it again? They're doing it again. Why did I eat my bait? First fish of the day. They're going crazy. See you later, fish. <laughs> That's a big oh one. That's a big one. It's a giant. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. He came up. Oh, my gosh. <gasps> Oh my gosh! Get in the boat! Oh. Holy cow! That's what I'm freaking talking about. Holy cow! He didn't get off, he ran and jumped in the boat. Oh my gosh! That's a big one. Wow! Gosh dang, Jay, that's a big one. <laughs> look at the head on him. I know, look at his mouth. A big old googly eyes, look at him. Yeah. Fantastic yes. fish, Jay. Good job. Wow. We've been out here like five minutes and you've already smoked not, two good ones. And there's some more different. schooling. There's schooling out there. Look at that. Oh my gosh. This is this exciting. This is so cool. Okay, let's get a good look at him. Awesome fish, Jay. Hey, Joe, what'd you catch that on? Caught him on my clout. Man, that worm is dangerous, guys. That's yeah. that new six cents clout worm. That thing is deadly. It's a big one, Jay. Sorry, I can't yeah. really talk. My heart's like racing. All right, I guess we can go on ahead. This and... fish caught me off guard. I like, look, he was like right in front of the boat. Yeah, when I guess whenever they're not schooling, they're hanging underneath these pads. So I guess we can maybe dial in it. Oh my gosh, they're doing it out there. Okay, okay. Yeah. Well, that was super exciting. This is probably like a four pounder. Yeah. Okay, I gotta send him back because the fish are going crazy, guys. He's ready to go. Awesome. Good job. Give me some, Jay. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, nice. that's what I'm talking about. Check nice. that dude out right there. That's a good one. Probably two and a half pounder. Caught him on that, uh, I actually got this bait yesterday at the Forest Wood Cup. This is an evergreen shower blows, little pencil popping bait. They're out here running bait everywhere and this bait causes a big disturbance, big commotion on top of the water. And uh, he couldn't resist it, got all the hooks in. It's an awesome little fish. There's some big ones out here and I feel like one of them is gonna hook up with a really big one here in a minute. I hope so. so. That's awesome. Okay, let me get him unhooked, get him back in the water. There he is guys, my first fish of the morning. I say it's morning, it doesn't feel anything like morning. It's like 105 degrees outside. We have an excessive heat warning and I'm I'm hot. It's all right though. We get some big bass. Getting back in the water. I'm gonna little toss up this grass. Ready? Yep. One, two, three. See ya. See ya, baby. Thank you guys. So I'm just now realizing that I wasn't recording on my GoPro for my fish catch. Just caught my top water bait. But oh well. Happens sometimes. Maybe we'll catch a couple more here. The wind just now started picking up. So that could be a good thing or a bad thing. It's good for us because it feels a little bit better. But I'm not sure if the fish are gonna continue school on bait. But we'll just stick around and find out. I swap up those white bait around a little bit since the wind's picked up. It's like the perfect scenario for this bait. I think that's all she wrote for this spot, guys. We've been uh, camped out here in this area for about 45 minutes since our last bite. I think we missed the feeding window. They were schooling like super heavily while we were doing the unboxing. Caught those fish right off the bat, some good fish, saw some more good fish, and weren't able to capitalize on some bites. But uh, we feel like they'll probably pick up again here in a couple hours as the afternoon progresses. But I think until then we're gonna head back inside. It's really warm out here. I mean, it's literally like 100 degrees without like the heat index. It's really hot. It might be the hottest day of the year. 
So we're kind of parched, gonna go inside get some water, take it easy, and I guess we'll keep an eye on them, and if they start picking back up this afternoon, we'll come back out here and give it another shot, but I guess we're gonna head in for a little bit. We'll see you guys back at the house. But nothing else really transpired on the leg this afternoon, so I guess we're gonna end today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with us today. Hope you enjoyed the unboxing of our Angler's Hall subscription box. It was really awesome. Say so thank you to them for sending it to us. And we hope you guys enjoyed our spontaneous fishing mission today. It was so much fun. This bait right here, the six cents clout, was definitely the killer today. It sure was. Yeah. You caught a big one with it. Oh, yeah. You caught a bunch of bangs with it since it's released. Yeah, this it's been thing awesome is awesome. Work. So we're definitely gonna leave the link to this. I was using the cinnamon crave. We'll leave that down in the video description and also the link to Angler's Hall. So be sure to check that out. But anyways, that's gonna be it for today's video. We hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, be sure to hit the like button for us and subscribe to our channel so you can keep with all of our future outdoor adventures. We're, we're Cole and Jay, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye, Bye. guys.